greetings on Wani and welcome to Wani's house. In today's video, guys, I am finally getting around to sharing with you what I have in my two credenzas that I recently purchased. So originally, my what I wanted to do in these two niches here on both sides of my fireplace is that I wanted to have shelving built across and then I wanted to have cabinets in the bottom. Now, why did I want that? Because your girl needed some extra storage for all of her toys, all of her dishes and things like that that I um, have accumulated. And so I needed storage. So which is why I wanted to have a cabinetry. Now, I never was able to find the cabinetry that I wanted. Um, that was one of my um, dilemmas, trying to find already built cabinetry. Then it became, I'll find a carpenter to build the cabinetry as well as the shelving. I want a glass shelving. That fell through also because I could not find reliable carpenters to come in here and do the job for me. And I just didn't want all those people in and out my house during um, this pandemic. So what did I do? I went out and I tried to find and um, source some, an alternative and I came across these beautiful credenzas and they are absolutely beautiful. They are um, relatively tall, it is very deep. So I have a lot of room for storage. A lot of the credenzas that I was finding, or buffets that I was finding out there, they were had the right height, but they were kind of shallow as far as the storage space. So these are actually, were actually perfect. Um, I shared with you on a previous video how I kind of upcycled them a little bit by spray painting the, um, the handles as well as I spray painted inside the um, oval here gold because that is my accent color um, in this room. Actually, you can find it throughout my home. So for this video, like I said, I have shown you how I currently have the top of the credenzas decorated, but now I'm gonna show you what I have on inside each credenza and how I have um, customized it to fit my needs. So originally, inside the credenzas, um, it was it's outfitted for a refrigerator because it's actually um, a TV stand or TV credenza that you would have found inside um, the Buckhead Hilton. And so inside it was a refrigerator. I of course did not want to have a refrigerator in here. And then part of me thought maybe I would put a refrigerator in here because it would be great for entertaining. So my idea now is this now is my bar area. And what I love about this space is that when we open up again, I can actually use this as a bar over here. I could also have some um, refreshments. I could have some um, crudités, uh, charcuterie boards, things like that. So this actually becomes another surface in which I can entertain from. So like right here, which is why I have this um, bar set up here with my glasses, as well as some um, adult beverages, a little spirits, and all the things that are the utensils that I would need for this bar because of under here is where you're gonna find the accessories to accompany this. So come on, come on inside. Let me show you where I am storing some of my goodies. Okay, so we're gonna open up the cabinet. And on this side of the cabinet, you see I have all of our adult beverages, wine, spritzers, any kind of whiskey. All of it is right here. It's up here. And so this is going to be um, organize more. I am actually looking for some containers that I'm actually going to put this stuff in or some type of bins. But because like I said before, this up here, it has a ledge and you would have the refrigerator in here. I um, measured this and got a piece of board to go in here. So I'm going to stain the board a really nice dark chocolate color um, like it is over here. 
And so that is what all of this stuff is. And then down here, because I have so many glasses and wine glasses. So that's what you see down here. I have my uh, martini glasses here with the rhinestone bottoms, a lot of my um, wine glasses, clear wine glasses, all of that is right here. So this area, all of this is mainly for this bar right here, okay? Okay, now on this side of the credenza, this is where you can find a lot of my entertaining pieces. I have my white and gold china set here and it has the um, little coffee cups with that if i should ever decide to use all of that together i have these champagne flutes right here because they couldn't fit anywhere else but now that i'm looking i think i'm going to put them down here right down here is where i have all of my glass pieces so I, those are the diy glasses um, plates that i did last year for the holidays I also have these thrifted um, appetizer plates here as well as these here. And I love these because these are thrifted as well. And so really cute little appetizer plate area right here where you would put your little cup for your appetizers. I love these. So whenever I see some new ones, um, that I think I can use, I get them. I also have in the back some plates back there as well. So now we're gonna go over to the other. All right, so now we're at the second credenza. And over here, let me show you what is in here. So in here is all of my mercury glass candle holders all my candlesticks anything that a candle can fit in um, that i would use on a table around my house is all up here and then down here as you see your girl has some more plates and i have some more but these are all of these here i have some christmas plates here you guys may remember these from the summer and these are actually from family dollar Aren't they beautiful? These, um, I have those there. Have some more appetizer plates as well as my seasonal plates back there, as well as some of the wooden appetizer plates that if I could find some more of these, and these are actually mingling plates, and you put your wine glass here, if I could find somewhere like these, definitely want those. Oliver likes these also. So that is what's in here. Okay, so let me show you this side over here. And like I said, you guys can see how deep these, um, these cabinets are, which is what prompted me to get them. So I have some coffee mugs here. These are some that I've had for several years from the Dollar Tree. And these are for the Christmas. I have some, a couple of shakers here. So I have this one and the gold one was also over here. And then I recently picked these up and these are little appetizer plates with the cup. Aren't these adorable? These are from Hobby Lobby and this is part of this um, spring shop collection. Y'all know I had to get those. So I want actually two more six sets of those and then I will have a, a set of six. These are some other candle holders that I couldn't put over there, but all these, these candle holders here are glass. And then back down here, I have all of my ginger jars. Some of um, these are some apothecary jars, any kind of vessel is gonna be down here and I have a lot of room and I will have more room. I can stack these on top of each other as well as the cups and then I'll have room here. So I have plenty more real estate down there. So guys, 
that's it. I wanted to make sure I got around to sharing with you what I'm currently using these credentials for. And once I get all the proper, um, the, all the proper baskets and containers that I want to go in there, I will definitely come back and show you again. But these are definitely great. I, I think I'm gonna have a lot of use for them, especially as the world begins to open back up. I plan to um, have a couple of people over. This is in my head. When it happens, I'll let you know. But I, I just want to be able to um, use these the way that I envisioned them to be used. And now that they are here and they're in their rightful place, I have so many um, great ideas on ways to use them. Not only are they beautiful to look at, because I really think they, I feel like they really frame out the room, but they're functional. They are so functional. And so um, as time goes on, you will see the various updates that I'll be making and I cannot wait to share them all with you. All right, guys, so that is going to be the end of today's video. If you are new to Mwani's house, I would love for you to subscribe. So go ahead, hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell. Also guys, did you know you can follow me on Instagram? You sure can, just go over to Instagram and you go to Wani's house, just like it is here. Hit that follow button and then you will be in the know as to what is to come over here at Wani's house. Also guys, I have a blog and you can go over there and follow me at www.wanishouse.com to see what I have going on. I'll give you recipes. We're talking about different types of lifestyle talk, but just things that um, I don't get to share with you over here. So come on over, go over there and follow me over there and subscribe. All right guys, so I hope you found this um, video useful if you wanted to know what does she have in those credenzas? Wani, what do you have in those credenzas? What are you using them for? Now you know. So guys, I am about to go, but before I do, you know what I always say. The next time you're in town, you can always stop by Wani's house and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.